In this video we shall take question number 31 of miscellaneous exercise of chapter 7, integrals, of N, C, E, R, T mass textbook, class 12. Hello friends, the question is like this. Evaluate the definite integral. Sine of 2x into 10 inverse of sine x dx from the limit 0 to pi by 2. Let us see that how we shall solve this question. Firstly we assume the given definite integral is equal to i. To begin solving, I write sine of 2x as equal to 2 sine x into cos x. So we obtain integration of 2 sine x cos x into 10 inverse of sine x dx from the limit 0 to pi by 2. Further we substitute sine x as equal to t. On differentiation of both sides with respect to x, we get cos x dx equal to dt. The value of upper limit will change to sine pi by 2, or 1. The value of lower limit will change to sine 0 or 0. On substitution we get the value of i is 2 into integration of t into 10 inverse of t dt from the limit 0 to 1. To make the simplification easier we shall not solve the integral with limits. We shall solve the value of integration of t into 10 inverse of t dt, and after solving it we shall apply the limits. This shall be solved by using integration by parts. We have taken 10 inverse of t as first function, and t is the second function. On applying the formula of integration by parts we obtain 10 inverse of t into integration of t dt minus integration of the product of d by dt of 10 inverse of t in integration of t dt, with respect to t. Now integration of t dt is equal to t square upon 2 and d by dt of 10 inverse of t is 1 upon 1 plus t square. Therefore we get 10 inverse t into 1 by 2 t square minus integration of 1 upon 1 plus t square into 1 by 2 t square dt, which can be simplified as 1 by 2 t square into 10 inverse of t minus 1 by 2 times integration of t square upon 1 plus t square dt. Further I add and subtract 1 from t square as shown. This gives 1 plus t square in the numerator as well in the denominator. Dividing 1 plus t square and minus 1 with denominator separately we get 1 by 2 t square into 10 inverse of t minus 1 by 2 times integration of 1 dt 1 by 2 times the integration 1 upon 1 plus t square dt. 1 by 2 t square into 10 inverse of t minus 1 by 2 into t plus 1 by 2 into 10 inverse of t. Taking 1 by 2 common from all the term we can write. The value of integration of t into 10 inverse of t dt as equal to 1 by 2 into t square 10 inverse t minus t plus 10 inverse t. Since we have assumed i is equal to 2 into integration of t into 10 inverse of t dt from the limit 0 to 1. Therefore we have i equal 2 times 1 by 2 into t square 10 inverse t minus t plus 10 inverse t from the limit 0 to 1. Now 2 into 1 by 2 will be 1. On solving the limits we have value of i is equal to 1 square 10 inverse 1 minus 1 plus 10 inverse 1 minus 0 square into 10 inverse of 0 minus 0 minus 10 inverse of 0. On simplification we shall obtain 2 10 inverse 1 minus 1. Now 10 inverse of 1 is pi by 4. So we have final value as 2 into pi by 4 minus 1. Or pi by 2 minus 1. Which is the required answer. Friends, thanks for watching my video. To watch more of these super videos and for the latest updates, subscribe and like the videos on these channels on YouTube HSK Shiksha and Math Help by HSK. Thank you.